What's up guys, welcome back to another tutorial. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to add achievements to Psych Engine. So to start, um, open your editing software of choice. For me, it's paint.net. Open. And find your folder. And once you find your mods folder, you're going to want to go to preload images and achievement grid now what you want what you're going to want to change is depending on what achievement you want to add if you just want to add a general achievement then canvas size or well this is how you do it for paint.net i don't know how you do it for other softwares but basically, each one of these rows is 150 pixels tall. So, for example, in paint.net, we can use canvas size, add another 150 pixels onto the bottom, and we have a new achievement goal. There we go. And if you're trying to add a weak achievement, then replace one of the already existing weak achievements. Um, so depending on what week you want, it needs to be that exact space in the icon grid. So this one's zero, so this would be week zero. So if you delete all other weeks, like you should for your mod, it would be week zero. If you keep the tutorial like some mods do, then you should replace this. Or if you keep all six weeks, you should replace this. So these will... So as long as your week is any of week one through seven, um, you should just be able to automatically replace the achievement and obviously change its name in the code, but we'll get to that. Now, um, this one we'll have to do a little finicky, uh, we'll have to replace a bit for, because this isn't a weak achievement, but, you know. Okay, so if you just want to do a general achievement, you know, do something random, like be a random, like a free play song. Let's say you want to make an achievement for being a free play song. So, you're going to want to download the base I've provided in the description, which I'll make right now. Alright, so yeah, you should be able to find a Google Live Drive link to this file in the description. Um, it isn't a perfect base, but it works. It'll be mostly covered up. So, you can obviously do whatever you want then. Um... Now start, let's get our weak icon thing. Well, actually, we won't really do our weak icon thing. Let's just use this as a little icon for this. Now how about this? We'll make this like a song one. So let's just save that. And go into achievements.hx. Now for your weak achievement. As you can see here, these are all the um, all the weak achievements. So obviously, depending on what you changed, um, it'll be different, and you can change whatever you want. Now you're gonna wanna add your own achievement. You're going to want to give it your achievement name. So let's just say Fresh Beats. And we'll do this as like an achievement for just being fresh. And then the description. I'll go ahead and do Beat Fresh. 
And finally, if it's hidden or not, which, no, it's not hidden. And then... You have the simpler name that you'll use in the files. No spaces or anything. We'll just do fresh beats. And you're gonna need if it's unlocked, which for every achievement it shouldn't be unlocked. Because I'll just make it so it's automatically unlocked. And then you can obviously add 16 if you want. But it's not important. So in play state, you're now going to want to search up achievement. And find check for achievement. And for every achievement you add, you should add a new one of these. There we go. And now you're just going to want to keep on skipping through until you can find private function check for achievement. Now this is the thing that checks for your song achievements or your weak achievements. So that should be automatic. You just need to add your weak number here. And, alright, so since we're doing a song achievement, we can just copy case 15. And replace test with fresh. And then you can save. Then, you're just going to want to run your game. Alright, so once you're in game, if you go into awards, beat fresh. So there we go. Let's go ahead and beat fresh to show that the achievement works. Alright, here we go. Beat it. And in the top left corner. Fresh beats. Beat fresh. There we go. And if we go into awards, we now have fresh beats unlocked. So, if you guys enjoyed this tutorial and it helped you, please leave a like and subscribe. Um, I have a full playlist of like 15 Psych Engine tutorials. And you know, I would really appreciate it if you went and watched some of them because I could really use some watch time right now and, you know, they might help you out. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, bye guys.